Squirrels are members of the family Sciuridae, a family that includes small or medium-sized rodents. The squirrel family includes the six types. Please support my work and subscribe, if you haven't already. Turn on the notification bell so you won't miss my new videos. Like, comment, and share. Number 1, Tree Squirrels. Tree squirrels are the members of the squirrel family commonly just referred to as squirrels. They include over a hundred arboreal species native to all continents except Antarctica and Oceania. They live among trees. Many tree squirrel species have adapted to human altered environments such as rural farms, suburban backyards, and urban parks. And because they are diurnal, active during the daytime, they have become perhaps the most familiar wildlife to most humans. The most common are The Red Eurasian Squirrel The Eastern Gray Squirrel And the North American Fox Squirrel Number 2, Ground Squirrels the most common two types are, the golden mantled squirrel and the 13 line squirrel. The golden mantled squirrel is a ground squirrel distributed in British Columbia and Alberta through the western United States to California, Arizona, and New Mexico. This ground squirrel is generally about 23 to 29 centimeters in length. Has whitish or yellow-gray underparts, the tail is brown to black with buff edges, and a yellowish to the reddish underside. The mantle across the shoulders is tawny to reddish, with males having a deeper reddish tinge. This species is distinguished from similar ground squirrels by a black bordered white stripe down each side of the back. This type of squirrel hibernates over the winter. It feeds on pine nuts, acorns, herbs and shrubs, fungi, many kinds of insects, eggs, young birds, lizards, carrion, and human foods when available. The golden mantled squirrel has also been known as a food beggar, because it begs humans for food at the wildlife urban interface. The 13 line squirrel, also known as the striped gopher, or leopard squirrel is a ground squirrel widely distributed over grasslands and prairies of North America. This squirrel is brownish, with 13 alternating brown and whitish longitudinal lines, sometimes partially broken into spots on its back and sides, creating rows of whitish spots within dark lines. The 13-lined ground squirrel is strictly diurnal and is especially active on warm days. It enters its nest in October, rolls into a stiff ball, and decreases its respiration from between 100 and 200 breaths per minute to one breath about every five minutes. It emerges in March or early April. The Arctic Squirrel The Arctic Squirrel is a species of ground squirrel native to the Arctic and Subarctic of North America and Asia. It has a beige and tan coat with a white spotted back. This squirrel has a short face, small ears, a dark tail, and white markings around its eyes. Arctic ground squirrels undergo a coat change from summer to winter. Summer coats include red-yellow colorations along the cheeks and sides of the animal. In fall, these red patches are replaced with silvery fur. The average length of an Arctic ground squirrel is approximately 39 centimeters. In the summertime, they store food in their burrow and feed on tundra plants, seeds, and fruit to increase body fat for its winter hibernation. Number 3, Chipmunks Chipmunks or Canadian squirrels are small squirrels found in North America, with the exception of the Siberian chipmunk, which is found primarily in Asia. They have also been referred to as striped squirrels, timber tigers, mini bears, and ground squirrels. Chipmunks have an omnivorous diet primarily consisting of seeds, nuts, fruits, and buds. 
they are said to sleep for an average of about 15 hours a day, in extensive burrows which can be more than 3.5 meters. Number 4, Marmots Marmots are relatively large ground squirrels, with 15 species living in Asia, Europe, and North America. These herbivores are active during the summer when often found in groups, but are not seen during the winter when they hibernate underground. They are the heaviest members of the squirrel family with short but robust legs, enlarged claws well adapted to digging, stout bodies, large heads, and incisors to quickly process a variety of vegetation. Total length varies typically from about 42 to 72 centimeters, and weight averages between 8 and 11 kilograms. While most species are various forms of earthen-hued brown, marmots vary in fur coloration based roughly on their surroundings. Marmots mainly eat greens and many types of grasses, berries, lichens, mosses, roots, and flowers. Number 5, Flying Squirrels Flying squirrels are a tribe of 50 species of squirrels in the family Sciuridae. They are not capable of flight in the same way as birds or bats, but are able to glide from one tree to another with the aid of a patagium, a furry, parachute-like membrane that stretches from wrist to ankle. Their long tail provides stability in flight. Molecular studies have shown that flying squirrels are monophyletic and originated some 18 to 20 million years ago. Most are nocturnal and omnivorous, eating fruit, seeds, buds, flowers, insects, gastropods, spiders, fungi, birds' eggs, and tree sap. Most cutest of all flying squirrel types is, the Japanese dwarf flying squirrel native to Japan where it inhabits subalpine forests and boreal evergreen forests on Honshu and Kyushu Islands. It grows to a length of 20 centimeters and has a membrane connecting its wrists and ankles which enables it to glide from tree to tree. It has large eyes and a flattened tail, white belly, and back covered with gray-brown hair. During the day, this squirrel hides in a hole, usually in a coniferous tree, emerging at night to feed on buds, leaves, bark, fruits, and seeds. They usually spend time grouped together on a single tree. Number 6, Prairie Dogs Prairie dogs are herbivorous burrowing rodents native to the grasslands of North America. They are a type of ground squirrel. Prairie dogs are named for their habitat and warning call, which sounds similar to a dog's bark. Their body is 30 and 40 centimeters long, including the short tail, and weigh between 0.5 and 1.5 kilograms. They feed primarily on grasses and small seeds, but can eat roots seeds, fruit, buds, and sometimes insects. 